To enter data that you have recorded on paper data sheets, start in your observation deck. Select the site for which you will enter data, then click the link to enter observation data. For each observation date, there is one column on the page. Enter the date on which you made the observation. Please note that you should enter the date on which the observation was made, not the date on which you are entering the observation, unless they are the same date. You can also select the time at which you made the observation. Three tabs at the top allow you to enter your contribution of time, your animal observation methods, and report on snow conditions at your site. For animal observations, it's very important to enter the time spent looking for animals and animal survey method, as the amount of effort you spend looking for animals and your method will greatly affect the number of animals you observe. Each individual plant and animal species at your site will have an individual tab on the page. You can expand or collapse each individual plant or animal species by clicking on the tab. Transfer your observations from your data sheets, marking a Y for yes, N for no, or a question mark for uncertain. If you are entering the intensity questions for plants or abundance questions for animals, you may enter your answers either by choosing from the drop-down for plants or for animals, entering a number into the field. Once you have entered all of your observations, Make sure that you click Submit Observations at either the top or bottom of the page. Don't forget to enter your animal search time and method at the top of the page. To see previous observations that you entered, use the blue arrows to move back one or three columns. For additional columns, click the button to enter more data. If you need to correct observations, you can go back to see your previously entered observations, change the observations you entered, then be sure to click Submit Observations to save your changes. Please note that you cannot change the date for an observation once you have submitted observations. If you enter the incorrect date, you will need to enter your observations again with the correct date. Click Submit Observations. Then you can delete the observations with the incorrect date. 